Hi everyone, back again. Thanks for watching. I appreciate um, you coming back to watch another video. Um, today I'm painting a flannel flower which is native to Australia and I'm going to paint it with acrylics, deco art acrylics. I'm only going to use two colours, white and forest green. And we're going to paint it on, it's a felt, felt surface. Okay. And we're going to start with the the petals. And I'm going to use an angle brush. It's a Zen Royal Lang Nickel. I'll load all the brush up with the white. I'm going to start at the, I'll just move it around. Start at the top of the petal, pull it in one side. Load the brush again, same way, point, pressure, pull in, load it up again, and bring the center in, okay? I'm going to do that on all the petals, so the side, both sides, like so, and then the center. Load up again. Like so. Go all the way around one side, then the other. These can have up to eighteen petals on them from 8 to, to 18 petals. They're grown all over Australia except for in the tropics. They're quite a popular flower in arrangements of bunches of flowers. There we are, we'll just keep them around. I'm up on the chisel of the brush, I'll pull in, chisel again and then fold it back, like so. Up on the chisel, pressure, come in. And then the centre. Now load up again. Doing that a little bit again. We're only going to go three quarters of the way down because we'll leave this area in shadow. Okay, in the same way, but only three quarters of the way down. I'm loading the brush up the same way. It's been a lovely morning here, but it's turned into a rainy, cold, wintry day. I suppose it's winter, we've got to expect it. Okay, now we'll put in the centre of this one, just to show you. You see that? Yep. Now how I'm going to load the brush is on the uh, tip of the brush, I will pick up like so and all I'm going to do is just dab in very lightly. I was at um, a computer class this morning trying to learn how to manage the uh, videos that I'm doing. I've got no idea really, I just do them. And they usually, when I send them to YouTube, they usually go on the wrong way. So we have a friend in America that will turn them round for us, Harold's, which I'm really grateful for. Um, I've just got to learn more on how to set them up, which is good. Well, we're isolated 
Yeah, now I've just come back and put a little bit of highlight in the center. Left it only with one coat here and a few little dots just to round that off a little. Now what we're going to do is the back into it again. I'm going to pick up on the, just on the point and I'm going to lay, lay it down like so and then run like that. Each petal pick up the same way, drop it down and then pull. We want that little bit of texture just on the top. I'll move it off to this side. So just on the point. A little bit of pressure and pull it in. We're going to do that on every one. Pressure, pull it in. This one, turn around. Bring it around. A little bit of pressure. Pressure, pull it in. Now to give that the impression that it's folding over a little, what I'm going to do is back into the paint, the white paint, we're going to flatten the brush off both sides like so. Okay. And then what we'll do is just run here, run up the side like so, on a slight angle. A little bit more. And just shake it back and forward. Just a little bit more. And you can see by this one where I've put it here, it just gives you the idea where it's folding over a little. So, if you need to go back and highlight it a little bit stronger, you can. This doesn't have to be done like this on the... Um, the felt board. You can do this on a canvas. It's the same technique, or on a um, a wooden board. Doesn't matter. I'm really just showing you the technique. Just put a little highlight here. There too. Okay, you can go back in the center again and just highlight a little bit in the center. And then um, I'll leave you with that at the moment. And in the next video, I will finish the other flannel flower and then we'll do the leaves. Okay, catch you then. Bye. Stay safe and well.